Here we go, Thir uh, 13,860, we've got the mix. Like, am I the only one to, like, again, I just saw one or two replays, so maybe there's a replay I missed. But I feel like that hit looked more than fine, did it not? The Wilson hit. Canvas of Giroux for the Flyers. What's up, Casey? How you doing, sir? Young Guns for the LA Kings, Mikey Anderson. That was dirty, you think? Interesting, Jamie. Again, my my view is a little far from the TV, but it didn't look like it was a hit to the head. Again, I haven't uh, seen it fully. Dylan Larkin, Dazzlers for the Red Wings. Base. Harkins, young guns for the Jets. Well, yeah, he definitely he definitely goes for the hit. There's no doubt about that. Oh, nice. That's awesome. Leafs goggles. I can show you, 8 feet what I see after this. Remind me and I'll show you the one camera angle that I normally can see uh, from here. I think you'll understand from my point of view. Rookies of Thomas for the St. Louis Blues. Authentic rookies. We've got a blue of Williams for the Canes. And a calm twam our rookie authentics for the Ducks. Stem goes for the Tampa Bay Lightning. And authentic profiles carry price for the Habs. Taves for the Hawks. And a Donato rookie authentics. For the Boston Bruins. If I show the game. Well, I don't think if I... I think if I broadcast the game. But if I think if I just show the screen quickly. Hyman for the Maple Leafs. We've got a Borgstrom for the Panthers. Authentic rookies for the Panthers. And eleven ninety nine of Middlestad for the Buffalo Sabres. Don't risk it. I, I don't... I can wait till a commercial goes. I'm not too concerned. We've got a authentic rookie, or sorry, authentics of La Joie for the Ottawa Senators. Blue of Ekblad for the Panthers. Rookie authentics of Brett Howden for the Rangers. KZ was this, like, I'm kind of curious, what's the LOL part for? McKinnon for the Avalanche. And a Profiles of Carlson for the Knights. Hold on, Jamie, are you, uh, are you a Boston fan out of curiosity? Copyright. That's funny. No? Well, then, then you're pretty impartial. That's fair. I'll give you that. We've got a Vancouver Canucks, Daniel Sedin, red. Anaheim Ducks, blue of Getzlaff. Newcomers of Lemieux for the Jets. For the Boston Bruins, Jake DeBrusque, red. For the Jets, line A, blue. And an exceptional talent of Lungfist for the Rangers. I just always ask because if you ever have conversations about somebody on teams, and, you know, sometimes they're a homer. Like, if you say anything about the Jets, just don't ever ask eight feet down about it. Samuel Blass 
Red rookie for the Blues. Jonathan Taves for the Hawks. Blue. And we've got a career spanning of Eisman for the Red Wings. Like, V. Golden is actually somewhat impartial. I'll give him that. He's a pretty impartial guy. Martin Nikas for the uh, Carolina Hurricanes. Red rookie. Nikita Sherback, blue for the Habs. And impact players of Forsberg for the Avalanche. Uh, sorry, eight feet is Jeff. Jeff. We've got a red of Patrick Waugh for the Habs. Hayden Fleury, blue for the Canes. And an exceptional talent of Malkin for the Penguins. Avalanche, JT Confer, red. Colin White, blue for the Sens. Impact players of Bellevue for the Habs. Coyotes, Max Domi, red. Green of Wayne Gretzky for the Oilers. Anna Nolan, Patrick Newcomers for the Flyers. For the Buffalo Sabres, Jack Eichel. Jack Eichel, red. We've got a Walmart for the Carolina Hurricanes. Is that the... Impact players of Marlowe for the Leafs. I'm not sure. That might be the purple version. You can get them slightly colorblind. So that's always fun. I think that looks a little more purplish to me. But I might be wrong. So if anyone wants to completely let me know, that'd be great. That's purple. Thank you. Portraits of Trocheck for the Panthers. Shining Stars of Crosby for the Penguins. Base. Nylander, Young Guns for the Buffalo Sabres. Portrait of Voracek for the Philadelphia Flyers. Game Jersey, Franz Nielsen. The only reason I think it actually might last is because with everything being shorted, things are going to dry up significantly. So I think it's just going to become significantly harder to find any good cards. But, again, will it last forever? Who the heck knows? Canvas for the Blues of Alex Petrangelo. Young Guns, random between Besser and Heischer. Devils and Canucks. Portrait of Ho Sang for the Islanders. But I do think it will last. I just don't know. There will be waves that it goes better and worse, obviously. Shining Stars of Shifley for the Jets. Young Guns of Barbashev for the Blues. Canvas of Paul Byron for the Montreal Canadiens. Shining Stars of Bobrovsky for the Jackets. Gets Laugh Portraits for the Ducks. Base. Hayden Fleury, Young Guns for the Canes. The only reason I think Golden might stay 
is all those people who invested in the big cards, they ain't just going to go nowhere. Matthews for the Maple Leafs canvas. They're still going to keep their cards, and those values are going to go up. I just don't know if all the boxes will go up or if it's just continuously McDavid and stuff will keep going up. Rasmus Anderson for the Calgary Flames, Young Guns. Shining Stars Rainbow, Granlin for the Wild. Miko Koivu for the Minnesota Wild, Canvas. And Sveshnikov, Young Guns for the Red Wings. Con is five thousand dollars season tickets or that is that supposed to be expensive, cheap, or normal? That sounds pretty damn cheap to me for a Leaf fan. It looked clean to you, interesting. Okay. And you got to remember, guys, there's been a lot of pop-up Facebook group breakers. Like, those guys are going to want to stay longer, which means it's going to bring in more new people to the industry. So, I, I do feel like the hobby is going to keep booming. I don't, I don't think it's going to randomly just crash. My personal opinion. For the Blue Jackets, rookie jersey to seven ninety nine of Cam Atkinson. Rookie jersey, Cam Atkinson. Invest in the big boys, yep. For the Maple Leafs, seven ninety nine, Matt Fratton. I think that's a, a smart investment right now with the hobby. Uh, Dan, I, I honestly think the exact same. I feel like there's going to be a good uh, good little scrap going soon. Flashback Fabrics. Saku Koivu for the Habs. Koivu for the Habs. You know what though, Jamie? I thought I thought that would happen when we opened up several times over the course of the year and a half, and it didn't. It didn't slow down anybody from spending. I thought when you know the second wave hit, it would slow down people. It literally nothing has slowed down people. Fine night of Zabinajad to four ninety nine for the Sens. Honestly, it's just gone like I've just noticed more new people starting to collect and buy, and it's it creates a frenzy. And what else to be able to remember is there's going to be so little product in our industry going forward. Everything's cleaned out. So if anyone wants boxes, your selection's not going to be very good in the next year. You're literally going to have only what's new. So I think it's going to be very interesting going forward what's going to happen with the hobby. Even with breakers. I said, I honestly expect in six months to a year, a lot of breakers are going to be... Uh, Struggling. For the Rangers, Cam Talbot. Rookie to 499. Cam Talbot. I really do feel that way. Dual jersey for the San Jose Sharks. Winning materials. Patrick Marlowe. Dual jersey, Patty Marlowe. And we got a dual jersey for the Rangers of Stahl and Lungfist. <laughs> well, we always plan ahead. I'll, I'll give you that. But for the auto, our Edmonton Oilers, Colton Tubert. You can plan ahead all you want. The problem is, is if things still sell, they still sell, right? Like... Like, let's say I get five additional cases of clear-cut 
that I'm like, you know what? Once it hits 200 bucks, I'll slow it down. But then people keep buying it at 200 bucks, and then 220, and then 230. Eventually, I'm gonna run out quicker than I thought. Like I literally ran out of series one fifteen sixteen when I was on my shelf for four forty nine, and I'm pretty sure that was less than a year ago. And when I rebought it, I still thought that was ridiculous to to put it on my shelf for five ninety nine, and now it's nine ninety nine. Duclair for the Ottawa Senators. Who are the top three breakers in the U.S.? C and then N and then C. Share of money. Rookie Redemption Avalanche. I don't think he knows. I definitely know. I know pretty much almost every breaker. Vegas Gold Knight, Shea Theodore. Honestly, there's a lot of good U.S. breakers. I'm a massive fan of if they don't have a store, they they shouldn't be considered in the tops. Um, I think any of the big boys who have the stores, they do more than a fine job. 175, Brent Burns. San Jose Sharks, dual jersey. I also believe in invest in the people who have invested in the hobby. I'm a big kind of stickler on that. 75 Patterson for the Vancouver Canucks. Such a gentleman. Sometimes I'm a gentleman. We got number 216, which is Nolan Foot for the Devils. Nolan Foot. For the Islanders, Semyon Varlamov. Can I elaborate? What 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 do you want me to elaborate? Which part? And for the Rangers, dual jersey of Panarin to 149. Oh, invest in people who invest in the hobby. Give me one second. I will finish my clear cut here and explain what my meaning is. And we've got for the Tampa Bay Lightning, Andre Vasilevsky. Here we go. 